Tonight, dozens of families in the North Country now have Narcan after they were trained on how to administer, administer the overdose reversal drug. Community leaders handed out Narcan at a forum in Lancaster. WMUR's Mike Cronin explains. No movie tickets being sold at this event in downtown Lancaster. It's a free discussion on the heroin crisis with a unique twist. Narcan kits for everyone who showed up. Eric Becker says there's a huge need for help in his community. When people in Manchester say there are no resources, it's a lot worse up here. A story echoed by so many in New Hampshire, Becker wants to do something about the heroin crisis. A lot of my friends are, are suffering um, and I've, I've lost some. He organized a forum, Heroin in the North Country, at Rialto Theater in Lancaster. Becker is part of the Black Crow Project, a documentary on heroin which he hopes will premiere next winter. Becker wants to get people talking. The people who are involved in it are already talking about it. You know, the legislators are talking about it, the healthcare, the police are talking about it. But we really got to get the community involved because uh, it's going to take all of us, you know, because when a man is suffering, his family suffers. And when his family suffers, the community suffers. About 100 people showed up to Friday's event determined to curb addiction in the North Country. Everybody basically has somebody in their life or they know somebody who has an addiction problem, so we might as well get involved somehow. Drugs really get a hold of them and it's just, I think it's time to start trying to really do something about it. After a short film, community leaders like Pastor Seth Frank provided spiritual support. There are people out there who understand, people that can help them, people that they can lean on. Frank's father was addicted to heroin. It wasn't heroin itself that took his life, but it was a car accident that was a result of drug abuse. Free Narcan was offered to everyone who attended. Becker says the state provided them about 200 kits. They told us this may be the largest distribution slash awareness event that's happened in New Hampshire. At the very least, organizers are hoping to start a discussion here in the North Country to work together in fighting the drug crisis. More information on the Black Crow Project can be found at WMUR.com. In Lancaster, Mike Cronin, WMUR News 9.